Hey Mike, what's up? Okay, here we go. So in here, right there, right there, here's the clams. Gonna go over to the microwave, pop it open, chuck it right in there, 15 seconds. Alright, there we are. And you can look at it, and there's just a little bit of water in there, and just kind of makes it kind of a little easier to get at, pick at. Alright, well now minute. we're going to grab one of these. It's kind of slippery. I'm just going to kind of grab one little chunk there. And pretty much that's what I'm going to feed them, if you can see that. Just about that much. Alright, then I'm going to take that and then I'm going to chop it up pretty good here. And I'm going to kind of get it stringy, depending on the piece you get. Sometimes they're really meaty, sometimes they're really stringy, but I'm going to kind of, I'm not going to go nuts on it, but I'm just going to kind of make it chop up into maybe like, I don't know, six pieces, eight pieces or something like that. I just don't want to have everything in one shot, so he takes it out in one mouth and then eats one bite and then the rest of it. Flips. And that's the final product right there. It's not a lot. He's going to eat that pretty quickly, probably in about a minute, just for scale. So barely anything. This thing is going to get the rock. It's the one right there. You'll be able to see it just with the rubber bands on it. And then just remember just to wash your hands before you go in there. Just don't use soap. If you want to grab it, it's probably like a snail or a crab or something like that. I'm just trying to knock them off. I just grab it out one shot. Take it off. Then there's two parts of the rock. This part and this part. I'm going to put the food on this part, the smooth part. So I just kind of pick it up. Then just kind of smear it in. Just like that. Okay, so now I'm done. I got the thing spread on the rock, kind of in a little strip. I spread it out kind of the same width as this thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this, I'm going to put it right over the food, I'm going to wrap it around, and I'm just going to take this rubber band, and I'm just going to wrap it. Wrap it on the top, twist it on the bottom, and then wrap it on the top again. And when I'm done, I have the food in the center. I got the food in the center, and I got the rubber band on the outside, twist it on the bottom. I'm gonna put it in the tank. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it really close to the glass up here. I don't want it close to the anemone because the anemone may get into things. But I'm gonna put it closer to this rock right here. So I'm just gonna put it in, and that fish should swim right up to it. And I'm gonna put it facing up, and I'm gonna have it facing to the fish right there. And there he goes, just picking it right there. I'm going to kind of just push it away from the anemone just a little bit. Alright, now while it. I'm at it, I'm going to do the, uh, I'll show you how much I give the frozen food. So I've got the cube, I'm going to shave it, and it's not a lot, and it's just literally just shaving it right off. That's it, right there. So it's literally going to work out to be that much on the end of the knife. That's almost maybe a little too much, but probably about that. Maybe for even argument. sake, let's just say like that much. And then uh, just hit the feed button and then chuck it in and you're good. Thanks again, Mike. You guys are awesome. Alrighty, ciao.